I've done the 10 minute beat challenge a long time ago. I still think that 10 minutes is not enough time to make a decent track. Um, do you think I can do it? A few years ago, I did the 10 minute beat challenge um, and it was fun. Um, it was a good exercise in songwriting with time restrictions. It forced me to be more in the moment and to not overthink stuff. I wonder if I actually became better since my last attempt. I don't know. You be the judge. Let's do this. All right, here we go. So whenever I start a track, I always start with a template. Um, it has all the basic instruments on it. Um, it's got the bass, it's got the drums, it's got the uh, synths and all that stuff. It makes, the, uh, it makes my workflow a little more quicker. And I think being a drummer myself, I usually start with the drums. There's a nice four on the floor beat. And then right now, what I'm doing is I am looking for hi-hat loops. I usually program my hi-hats, but in the interest of time, I will be using loops instead. And what I'm doing right now is I'm trying to um, alter the envelopes of the uh, hi-hat loop to make it more tighter. Copy and paste. Now I'm not a keyboard player, so I use this plugin called Cthulhu. It enables me to play full chords just using one note on my keyboard controller. I think this sounds decent. Let's record it. I think that will do. Copy and paste. Fix the MIDI notes a little bit. Sounds like a good chord progression. And right now what I'm doing is I'm recording the MIDI from Cthulhu into a MIDI track. This way I can alter the MIDI chords and use it in other instruments. And then next I copy the MIDI chords and make a bass line out of it. This works. Sounds a little funky. I think I'm happy with this. Whenever I figure out a melody, um, I just play around with notes until it makes sense in my ears. And 
sometimes it can be uh, really frustrating. I think I need a new keyboard stand. Okay, let's fix this one a little bit. The timing is a little off. And let's record this one more time. sounds good just take the first bit I think it sounds good I made an Ableton instrument um, using a vocal sample and then pitching it and playing it around like a keyboard Same as playing any melody, I play around with notes until it makes sense to me. I think it sounds good. Let's record it. Just a little simple, like secondary melody, just in the back. play around with the effects a little bit to give it a bit of a bit of a character I think it's uh, sounding a little decent it's, uh, I think it sounds listenable Typically, it takes me a few hours, maybe even days, to finish a song. And that doesn't include mixing and mastering. Finishing a song is sometimes challenging. There's a lot of starts and stops. And sometimes you end up with a song that you don't really like. And that's okay. I think that it's all about the process. If you like this video, give me a like, comment, and subscribe. Also. Subscribe to my newsletter to be updated on more videos like this and also cool updates and free downloads from your favorite Kuya. So yeah, let me know what you think. Let me know what you want me to do next. Until next time, see ya!